first uh, commentary video I'm gonna do it on a trophy a trophy list for a game called Heavy Fire Afghanistan well let me just say that this game is, is horrible it's the worst first first person shooter I've ever played before and see I got one trophy right there it's just some easy trophies for completing some missions uh, you got trophy list is pretty simple there's only 28 trophies um, there's some for you know blowing blowing uh, certain amount of objects up you got some for headshots. You got um, was it like how many bullets you fired, which is fairly simple. Like I don't, I can't think that one's for how many like you you get like a uh, kill streak, like kill streaks, but like when you kill so many people, amount of people at once. If you get if you kill three people at once, it's a trophy. You kill five people at once, it's a trophy. And then once you kill ten people, all you know with one basically one streak, it's it's a trophy. Basically, all you need for that is just to, uh, you know, blow, throw a grenade. Throw some. You'll see some of the red barrels, explosive barrels. You blow them up in a good area, and you'll get them. Uh, there's a chopper later. You fire a chopper. You shoot a couple rockets, and bam, you got them all together. Uh, if you notice this game, the reason why this game is so horrible. It's like an arcade game. Like this game should never be released on a console. It's, it's ridiculous. You see right now. It's like if you notice as I'm playing. You can't control anything but where you're shooting at the screen. You don't control where you walk. You don't control what you look at. You only control the little crosshairs that go over the screen. It's like one of those games. I think it's like Time Crisis. That's what it reminds me of. So basically, you don't control anything but the arrows. I mean, granted, that game was awesome, but only when you were like a you know an arcade kind of place. This this game does not belong on a on a system at all. But it is, and it gives me an easy platinum. And it's, if you guys want platinums for your uh, for your trophy list, this is an easy one. It took me maybe probably a maximum of 10 hours to do it because I was just got so bored of it because it is a really horrible game. But it's it's an easy one. It really is an easy one. You'll see, like when you take damage, they'll a little uh, exclamation mark will pop over the head. Basically, when that happens, they're about to shoot, and you got to hide behind cover. Yeah, you see there, there you go right there. And then when they do shoot you, you know, you get a couple things. There's ammo packs in the ground. You see the little, the little blue uh, health sign. You got uh, ammo crates. Not ammo packs, it's health, health packs. The grenade. You get little upgrades, different guns, and then you don't get to switch to your pistol. It's when you run out of ammo for your main gun, it switches to your pistol automatically. And that weapon is in from ammo. You see, you get, I'm just getting the ones after completing your, you know, submissions different trophies. This one's for the first regular playthrough. You have to play through it twice, which doesn't take long at all. So this is the easy one. It goes rookie mode and then straight to veteran mode, which honestly the only difference is that the people shoot you faster. Like the exclamation marks come up quicker. Here's the chopper. Here's the one just, um, I don't remember what that trophy is, but uh, so yeah, it's just like that one. I got 10 kills with the, tro the chopper. You don't get to fly the chopper, you just get to aim. Which is again boring. It all, gets, it all does get really repetitive and boring. You'll see, you'll, see, like, you'll see a couple playthroughs have done it multiple times. The only thing I noticed different from the uh, veteran mode and easy mode was that some of the maps, some of the missions, like go from day to nighttime or night to daytime, which is pointless to me. But you see how many? This is in a veteran mode. You see how many exclamation marks pop up now? This is a tank. The tank is really pointless there's no challenge it's just basically shoot and rack up the kills here's the end so yeah here comes the platinum trophies coming up so I'm gonna go ahead and end this one but so yeah if you want an easy easy platinum trophy this is one for you it takes a couple hours not difficult at all though so stay tuned and I'll come up with some more ones later probably next one probably be Kung Fu Panda 2 alright I'll see you guys later